Welcome to HDTV. You now rocking with your boy. LeBron fans, you guys don't need to jump off a bridge and kill yourself. He's going to bounce back. The Lakers are going to win the series. They're not going to let the Lakers lose in the first round, even if they have to foul three or four guys out the game for the Blazers. But this is what I'm telling you. All these excuses you're making before the game and then doing the Toon Squad jersey and then doing all this stuff, not focusing on what your damn job is. That's the problem I have with LeBron. He disrespects the game. He's been disrespecting it for years and now it's catching up to him. And people are like, oh, you just don't want him to win a championship. You're right, because he's not a great champion. He's not a great champion. He's never been a great champion. All he does is either complain or cry about fouls and cry about he don't have this and that. Look, man, you want to be great. You called yourself the GOAT. That's why I don't like Jay-Z either. You and Jay-Z are the same people. Jay-Z self-proclaiming itself the best rapper alive. You don't self-proclaim yourself that. You didn't put in the work like that. LL Cool J could do that because he's on a higher echelon. He got work, body of work to back up his GOAT claim. Michael Jordan could come out here and say I'm the GOAT because he backed it up. Bill Russell could say he the GOAT. He backed it up. God rest Wilt and Kobe sold. They could call themselves that because they backed it up. But you know why they don't? Because they know that the fans, they don't feel they're the greatest because they weren't able to play against other people or go against other people from different eras. LL Cool J put the name out there of the CD GOAT, but he wasn't running around saying, oh, I'm the GOAT, I'm the GOAT. No, he didn't. He just put the title out there. And you guys keep telling me about numbers and stats and all of this. Peyton Manning has way better numbers than Tom Brady, but who has more hardware? And before you talk about, oh, look at the teams and the coach, man, Peyton had good coaches. But Peyton kept turning the ball over and making bonehead decisions. But um, I'm just making a little video before I go into work, but... Like I said, like, comment, subscribe, share, and let me know in the comment section how you feel. Do you feel the Blazers are going to sweep or win? I still think the Lakers are winning five. And I still got the Bucks winning like in five. Maybe six. But I said before the series, you this is different. This is a toss-up. You got to play. This is old pickup ball. When you came to the park, you had your five. We had our five, and we run it. So let me know what you feel. If you feel LeBron James is getting a pass, do you feel that the Blazers are going to win it? Let me know. Um, This weekend, I'm going to do a video on the first week of the playoffs. I got it recorded. I'm going to look at the games. I work a lot, so when I have a chance, I'm going to break that down for you guys. Again, like, comment, subscribe, and share. And please um, hit the notification bell. Please select all so you can receive upcoming content. Um, go on the page in Cuba Gooding Jr. I have his case up there talking about if he's innocent or guilty. Um, I have other I have other stuff out there too, um, talking about um, talking about the U.S. Census. How if you don't do it, how it will affect your pockets as a community. So um, thank you for listening, and we out, live boy.